Previously on Big Brother. Housebats, it's time to enter the arena. Merry Christmas in July. The first round is Santa's shaky sleigh ride. The next round is slippery spelling. The next round is the battle for baubles. Santa has replaced his sleigh with a quad bike and the reindeers are not happy. Jamie, you are the winner of the Friday Night Games. God, just want to celebrate me! Who do you choose to take to the rewards room? Um, I'd really like to take Chris. Jamie, which box do you choose? Uh, box number two. Oh, yes! You have won a fast and funky TGB F409 motor scooter. Awesome! Thanks, big brother! Tonight on Big Brother, surfs up. Camilla and Max get down. The dancing chair. And David's gone a little sideways. Come home to me, he's gonna come home to me. I, swear, I think they're missing out. Yeah, yeah so me do too. I. This is wicked. It's pretty classy, guys. Friday night's games are over, and while most housemates settle down to their dinner, in the rewards room, Jamie and Chris are in for a special surprise. <laughs> this is Big Brother. Jamie, Chris, listen carefully. In the covered container, there are two wetsuits and two sets of cold weather gear. You have to dress in these immediately. Earlier, Big Brother told Jamie he'd won an additional prize for him and Chris, but before they find out what it is, they need to dress for the mystery occasion. Like sharks or dolphins no or something? Idea, but... Ah, this is awesome. So for me, what's it for you? And then wow. there was five. Uh, Those actually morning. look good. Mm, actually. Oh, yeah. Actually. Everyone, bon appetit. Mm, thank you. Oh, it's pretty spicy. So we put on the wetsuits now? Um, wetsuit first, yeah. I'm assuming. I'm going to look like a frog. <laughs> Sounds way corny, hey, but I just want to say to Max, like, and if Chris was here and everything, it's such, such a welcome yeah, yeah. thing having you guys here, oh, hey. Definitely. Like, you a breath of fresh air. You have absolutely mm -hmm. made the last couple of weeks bearable and livable and enjoyable and fun. This is Big Brother, Jamie, Chris. You are about to leave the Big Brother house. Take a blindfold from the wall and cover your eyes securely. In a few moments' time, you will be guided from the house. You are free to talk to each other, but make no attempt to talk to anyone else. This is, oh man, this is cool. Yeah. This is this is what makes the experience, hey? Like, exactly. So stuff like for, this. Here for under two weeks, I get to do something like this. Yeah. Thanks for inviting me, man. Man, no worries. Jamie and Chris are going on an exclusive out-of-house experience. However, contact with the outside world is strictly controlled and they're blindfolded for the entire journey. Their final destination is the new Flowrider skill ride in Dreamworld. And on their arrival, a pro is demonstrating how it should be done. This is Big Brother. Jamie, Chris, you may take your masks off. <laughs> oh, no way. <laughs> Big Brother hopes you enjoy yourselves.
a massive meal. It's so good. Huh? Go, Crystal. The boys actually missed a good meal for us. <laughs> Back at the house, the rest of the group have no idea what the boys are up to, but a lucky three are about to find out via a video phone call in the diary room. Jamie, as winner of the Friday Night Games, you may choose three housemates to share this experience with you. Who do you choose? Oh, man. Um, I'll choose... Oh, it's so tough. Um, Crystal, Camilla, and, um... And Claire. No, 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 that was a different His one. big brother, Camilla, Claire, Crystal, to the diary room. We're going to say something. Oh, yeah, bastards. We're going to say where they are. Yeah, we'll just stay here. <laughs> hate you guys, hate you guys. Suck it in, Crystal. Yes! In the middle. Okay. Oh my god! <laughs> I've never no, no, played for so long. Go on, push it. <laughs> oh my god! Where are you? Where are you? Are you in a chopper? Check out this surf thing behind us. We're going surfing. You got it! Chris is going to show you how it's done. Then I'll show you how bad I am. Are you serious? You guys can see that? Oh, no way! That's awesome! Look, watch this. You can see him coming down. <laughs> yeah! Now, then I'm going to show you how bad I am. Go, Jamie! Are you having fun? Jamie's going to go and outshine me now. Woohoo! He's got to do one. <laughs> yeah! yeah. <laughs> That's awesome! That We were like, it's gonna be a romantic dinner, but it was this. It's like, yes. What? Here's Jamie, hang on. Hey right, guys. Right, ready, yeah? oh, we miss you! We miss you already, Love guys. you, Jamie! Guys, wish you could be here. Oh, oh thanks for sharing it with us. Have mad fun! Woo! <laughs> <laughs> Woo! How big's your big toe? Very. Oh. That is huge! Lydia, no. It's a nice big toe, bud. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Next, Jamie comes clean on his feelings for Crystal. So obviously, you think she's gorgeous. Like, who even thinks she's a really good looking girl? Yeah, yeah, her, me and her are probably the most compatible. To evict Crystal, SMS Crystal to 199 evict. To save Crystal, SMS Crystal to 199 to save. Or call 1902 555562 and follow the prompts. Trying to do a big workout tomorrow? Oh my god. Huh? Here comes trouble. One hour after leaving the Big Brother house, Jamie and Chris returned from their surfing experience. I'm sorry, Dave. I'm sorry, Max. They asked me to do so, oh, I'll just, I'll just impress the girls. Jamie had to choose three housemates to share in the surf visit via a video phone. His decision meant David and Max were excluded from the experience. I felt I was like, oh, I don't want to change it. Actually, I want to change it, man. I can't change it. What do you mean? No, oh, what do you mean you God. wanted to change it? No, I want everyone to see. I'm so excited to watch you guys. I missed you too. I was so Thank you for inviting us. Thanks for Thanks for sharing it with us. Yeah. We were like, oh, we picked some girls, yeah. <laughs> we're like, I yeah. missed you guys so much. Oh, are you so excited? Yeah. Oh Felt God. really good to leave and just go, I don't want to leave this house. Like, and seeing you guys on the little thing, I was like, oh, I can't wait to come back. And... Oh. 
You have to put blindfolds on and just sit there. Claire and I were saying what better you people could you have picked? Oh, like, yeah. they would enjoy it more? I think they just put, okay. Mine said, mine said ML, this and he said L. This is Big Brother. Medium, large, and medium, large, I think. Housemates, it's time to reattach to your climbing partner. This week's mountaineering task is not over. With Jamie and Chris back in the house, it's time to reconnect the ropes, but not without some team reshuffling. Jamie, Chris, you are now the blue team. Uh, yeah, Camilla, do it. you are to join Max and Crystal on the red team. All task rules now apply. Are there ones in the rewards room? Must be. Um, Jamie, must be. Chris, you are not required to wear your climbing belts inside the rewards room. Housemates, attach to your team members now. That is all. Oh, at least uh, you guys get to be together. That'll be cool. I'll be in the middle if you like. I'll be in the middle if you like. Oh, you're going to hate it, Camilla. The three climbing groups are each connected with 40 metres of rope. Not only must climbing partners remain linked to each other at all times, but a member of each group must always be attached to one of the lifeline hooks positioned around the house. <laughs> Uh, okay, do you want to attach this to you? I would not walk out of the rewards until this task is done. Mm. Me neither. Yeah, it pissed me off. <laughs> I hope we pass this task. It's not as annoying as the pirate, but personal it's freedom just, is yeah, a good thing. Intrusive. Yeah. Who's coming? What do you think? You, you're gonna get irritated with me. I'm not. Yeah. <laughs> Sweet ass. Ah. Oh. Tired. This is gonna sound funny, but what? Why does that sound funny? Why is that funny, Camilla? It's only Oh, because like nature. it's not like it's like I've had more male attention than I've had in three months in the last week and yet. Well it's been sort of a taste for you, so there's yeah. no reason. It's because you, you haven't have really done anything. Want. Exactly. I don't know. I can't wait to get out. In that sense, like yeah. with the boys and makes it fun. Boys. I don't want boys, I want men. Men. So yeah, at the that, very start, were you ever saying. half half interested in Crystal? Um, obviously, you think she's gorgeous. Like, who even thinks she's a really good looking yeah. girl? Yeah. Um, Everyone would. I suppose, like to begin with, when I first met Crystal, I thought, yeah, on paper, yeah, her, me and her are probably the most compatible. But as it's gone on, like we just became sort of, uh, like, I'd, even though she's pretty, I still don't, I just don't see her in that way, sort of thing. Yep. That's why I was like pissed off with. Um, I see the way you look at Crystal and stuff, I'm like, what? I'm not good. Who said that? No, it came oh, in. Okay, like, and that. I was just like, man, I'm not doing, like, first of all, I haven't done anything. I'm not going to do anything. And, like, how stupid would I have to be? Yeah, like, yeah. that, I mean, that's beside the point. I'm not going to do it, but, I mean, who did, like, yeah. I can go and hug Claire, and I can go and hug Claire. Even for three months, that's a different. Yeah, but, no, but the thing is, I can hug those two and, like, go, oh, but I feel a little bit weird if I'm doing that with Crystal because I think that it's going to be interpreted the wrong way. Yep. Did you think I ever say the L word? You and Galen? Camilla, no. come on. I don't know. <laughs> if I were to say it to him and if I actually felt it, even if I did feel it on him, I'd want it to be between me and him, not like I'm doing some bloody bold and beautiful yeah. line. Like, I don't want it like that. I oh, know, yeah. but at the same time... If you mean it, you say it. I want it yeah. if I mean something, I'm... Yeah, you... and it, I, it actually takes time for me, though. I have to... T it takes a bit longer than that for me to confirm how I feel. And... I, if things on the outside went as well as they did in here, I could so see myself definitely falling for him. And I just... Falling yeah. do. Yeah, heaps. I can see it so much. And um, I think mainly we were just more like friends than anything, and that's good. That's what I want. Yeah. Well, time will tell when you guys get out. Yeah. 
Yeah. yeah. Like that's not, I mean, I want more than that, but that's what I wanted to be. I wanted to be friends first, and I like, I like that. Get to know each other's lives. It's the best part of the there. relationship is being friends. That's what I love. Best, best, best part of being with someone is that whole puppy love stage when yeah. you get to know each other and yeah. you're cute and cuddly, can't keep your hands off each other's so. Yeah. How are you finding things with Cam? She's cool, man. Yeah. She's cool. <laughs> I find it cool, man, that a lot of the stuff that I want to say to her, you just say. And I'm like, he said it, he said it. <laughs> so much this time, man. And I hope to hold back like I think you're getting away with um, you're getting away with more and more, so. I think it's I think it's good for her as well. Yeah, to tell definitely, the truth. Definitely, man. I was gonna say the same thing, and even she said that to me. Mm. But yeah, I never, I never came in, or even now, I'm like, she's cool, you know, and that's, uh, that's about it. Like, it's not like I'll be like, yeah, we have a mad romance or something like that. Yeah. I, mean, I will tell her eventually. I'll, I will have a chat with her about that stuff. But I don't think that's what she's looking for either. Um, yeah, it's pretty, it's a big move to sort of commit yourself to one person in here. Massive. So, like, yeah, me and Camilla haven't even kissed yet. And I'm like, yeah, I'm really, really hesitant to. So, yeah, the last two nights with Cam, I've tried to cool down a little bit, actually. Like, all there's been yeah. is a bit of a hugging, and that's that's been about it. Um, and it's nothing to do with her, even. It's so me about it. Like, I'm just very, like... I think she's awesome, as, as I've said to you, but I don't know about in that sense yet. You know what I mean? Yeah, man. And it's not even, like, on the outside world, I'm exactly the same. Man, so am I, hey. Exactly the same. Coming up, Camilla questions Chris's motives. I said to him, if you'd been here from the start, you would have spent you wouldn't have spent much time with me. What's going through that blue head? To evict Claire, SMS Claire to 199 evict. To save Claire, SMS Claire to 199 to save. Or call 1902 555574 and follow the prompts. might do a um, throat exercise because <laughs> I do have a sore throat and I'm do sure you? many of you do as well. It's a late rise for all housemates and Claire leads the morning aerobic session with some unusual exercises. So you don't damage anything and you just press into the neck <laughs> and we might do a simple la 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 Might do a um, Jane Fonda style. Reach and over. Reach and over. Reach and over. That's it. That's it. We'll go for five more. Four, three, two, one. Good work. Uh, Maximus, what would you like to do? This is Big Brother. Housemates. Your aerobic session is over. Oh. Yeah. God. We can go Thanks, eat. Claire. The hot water is now on. All right. Um, bathroom, Dave, or bedroom? Bed. Bed? OK. Um, I see us not passing this, actually. You smell... I said I can see us not passing this. And not because of any other reasons, but we st stood on the road. I think that they'll make that. That we stood on the road? I think that that might be the reason we failed. All housemates except for Jamie and Camilla are facing eviction this week, and the impending event seems to be on everyone's minds. Why is everyone so sure this is going to be a double eviction? Is it just... Um, and I don't know how much you know, but everyone just seems to, to think it's a given. Whereas if it had been, you know, if those nominations hadn't changed... It would just been three up. Three people up. What makes people think... I think the only reason they think it is because Camilla and Chris Fullman are pretty certain that there's three weeks max left. And so if only one goes this week, right, there's six left in three weeks. In two evictions afterwards, you mean? I yeah. think you mean. So there's three evictions and three... I don't know. It might not be, and there might be one next week instead. Yeah.
together. Jamie, Chris, breakfast is served in the rewards room. It smells so rewards in here. It's the place of rewards. Do you reckon? Dave, did you think the longer we were going to be here, the more we might have got spoiled? Yeah, fully. Same. That's what we were talking about last night, and then they gave us a couple of stickers bars. <laughs> like, yeah, yay! That's not a compensation, and with all the complaining about weight and stuff, that's not really... No, that's not it's I not really the right approach, but seriously, I appreciate that. The amount of stimulation in this place is pretty... That's the atrocious. Idea. Isn't it? And I understand that we're meant to this is a be creating way. layers. Yeah, I know. Layers. We're, we're living pretty, like, pretty well, but, no, but it's not as well as I thought. I just thought it would just get better, you know. I suppose whatever they give us, we'll always want more. Whatever. I just, I did think we would get spoiled a bit more as time went on. You can still you can still play the games and have fun with it without mm. looking like a dick, though. You yeah, can, man. You can definitely. But you know, I know people do just take everything like little competitions like that. Well, the most similar stuff you can get to that at home. Mm. Way too seriously, and like it's made me sort of really dislike competitive people. But I was like, man, just chill out. Yeah, I'm a little bit confused, though. Why would someone hug you all night and, like, be cuddling you and kind of kissing your back of your neck and stuff? Even though Chris could have slept in the rewards room last night, he chose instead to sleep next to Camilla. This has her questioning his intentions. No, but what, you know, what's going through that boy's head? I said to him, if you'd been here from the start, you would have spent you wouldn't have spent much time with me. Mm -hmm. And he said, Why do you think that? And I go have been in the boys group. I go, because popular belief was that I was a pain in the ass. And you wouldn't have wanted to go against that. And he goes He goes, Camilla, I don't care what other people think. I do exactly what I want. And yeah. I believe that actually. I didn't think you were a pain in the ass, Camilla. Can you focus that? Hot. Sure oh. thing. Hey, do you think if Chris had come in here and on, say, the second or third night, he'd passed you. Do you think... Second or third night in... In the house, he'd passed you. You mean right at the start? Yeah, just say the second or third night, he'd kissed you. Do you think that you would even be interested right now? Do you reckon? I don't think you would. Honest. Coming up, what's Big Brother up to now? Put the chore duty statements in the bin next to you. Oh, oh no. no. David! To evict David, SMS David to 199 evict. To save David, SMS David to 199 to save. Or call 1902 555567 and follow the prompts. It's a lazy afternoon in the Big Brother house, and while Camilla and Crystal do washing, other housemates are soaking up the sun. Oh, what you thinking about, Dave? Um, Jamie, actually. Really? Yeah. Does anybody know what these towels that are soaking here are for? No idea. No idea. Claire Bear? No, didn't even know there was towels there. Stinks. Oh, really stinks. Oh, yuck, I can just smell that now. Ew. If anyone's gonna... Sorry, guys, I know it's probably not you guys, but if there are towels in here, we've got to do them because they just start to fester. Mm. What about Jamie Dove? Uh, just thinking it's, it's kind of... Um kind of unique for someone to be very comfortable with girls and be very, very, I suppose, girly in a way, but then very, very boys, boy, you know what I mean? Yeah. yeah. 
You know, there was a while there where, you know, Hiani just hung around. The boys. The boys. Yeah. And the now he's very only. much so girls guy. Just interesting. Very unique character trait, I suppose. Dave lets himself down, man, because he's a nice guy. And then at Wednesday night discussions and stuff, just like... Unleashes. Yeah. It's like... Absolutely on, unleashes. And it's just like, we're supposed to be friends. I don't know why he does it. Why man, would you do With Crystal the other night, he was speaking so down to her, like, ridiculously. Does it all the time. I wouldn't even mind so much if he did it on his own. Yeah. If he came up... And but he was, does it in front of everyone, like, so... Yeah, that's what gets me... If he came up to me and was just, like, talking to me and asking me, like... A bit more full-on questions than I would have expected, but it was just him. I'd, I'd feel a bit more like, oh, he just generally wants to know about me. You know what I mean? But when he does it in front of everyone, I'm like, you got a motive or something here, man. Like, there's a reason why you're doing this like this. There's a, there, man, I reckon there's a motive a lot of the time. And the thing is, like, I do really like Dave. Um, and I'm not just saying that to cover my ass. I do like him. Um, he was one of my favourite people from the start. He's just shown me little bits sometimes that throw me into a bit of a tailspin. I'm like, what? Yeah, you know, yeah. But, but I like you. Why would you say that? Oh, I don't know what I'd do without you in here, Camilla. Mm. <laughs> I know I'm negative, I swear. I thought about it yesterday and I thought, geez, I wonder if I make friends with negative people on the outside mm. because I'm negative or whatever. Like, so many positive people in this house. Am I negative? No, but I think sometimes really people sticky. feed off my, my negativities. <laughs> people are like, oh, God, she's not, like... <laughs> No, I like it. No, you're not. Oh, you're I real. Just... You, can... Mm. you can get annoyed. You can get upset. I would actually have gone insane if I hadn't had you here the last few weeks. I would have been like, who do I talk to? Everyone else is insane. I'm being realistic and I think that I'm not going to be friends with many people off this show. I know that. Yeah. Me too. I just want my life to be fairly normal. I don't want... I don't want people the pointing people... at me or anything funny like that. Like, that's something I've had to realise being in here is maybe that might happen and... Yeah. I don't want happen. that. I know, it's kind of weird. Yeah. I, I want to be able to have fun to be, I want to be able to um, hide as well. For a little while. Yes. Yeah. I think that the people... I hope we can go on a holiday soon, like... The only people I can honestly see myself being friends with after this is you... You and Claire. You, Claire, Jamie and Galen. They're the only people. I'll stay in touch with... Dave. Rob. Definitely you. I'll see Gales anyway. Yeah. All the time. Yeah. Betcha. I'll probably keep in touch with Chris. Apparently. Aren't they going to kill Wed and this Wild? This is Big Brother. Mm. All housemates to the kitchen. <gasps> housemates. You wagered 100% of your shopping budget on successfully completing this week's task. The results for this week's mountaineering task are in, and David is concerned that housemates may fail, as he and Claire are the only ones that paid attention to rope care during the week. The secret to success was communication. One member of each climbing team needed to be tethered to a lifeline hook at all times. Only one team kept their ropes properly managed. Housemates, you may remove your ropes. However, you have failed this task. <laughs> that is all. <laughs> we haven't failed in ages. So, uh, that's exactly. Let's go! <laughs> <laughs> and what, just run back into captivity? I'm yeah. going out in the rain. I'm, oh. <laughs> right. I gotta be. Coming up, Camilla digs for details on Chris. Well, what does he say about that? Because I, I could have put an end to it a week ago. 
to evict Chris, SMS Chris to 199 evict to save Chris, SMS Chris to 199 to save or call 1902 552582 and follow the prompts. Why are we doing the chores so late? Formerly known as Big Brother. All housemates to the lounge. Oh man, I haven't. What's this all Jenna, about? Collect the chore duty statements. What do you come think? to the diary room. I could have thought about it. I didn't. It's a big fat wing space. This must be about the task. The winner of Friday night's games normally has the responsibility of allocating chores for the week ahead. However, things are about to change. Really? All housemates to the lounge, please. Jamie. Big brother. Put the chore duty statements in the bin next year. Jamie, certain housemates have failed to carry out their chores properly. Uh huh. Even housemates have been complaining. Oh my god, if I'm dish pig, I'm gonna be so angry. Shop chef is the worst. Yeah, Janitor's boring. Camilla for president. Housekeeper oh, is the worst. Housekeeper is the worst. Groundskeeper is just oh, not so good. <laughs> Farmhand, everyone hates you. Big Brother provided housemates with this system to assist you all in managing the house. Yep. Given the housemates' attitudes, Big Brother is revoking the chores system. Mm -hmm. From today, it is up to housemates how the house is managed. I see. Let's do something ridiculous when he gives them to us. Let's so he gets embarrassed. We'll do something. What can we do? Well, I'm going to yes, go like get this. Get out of here. Get out of here. All right, guys. Ooh, something Ooh, different. Oh. Left him in there. Oh, no. Oh, no. no. Jamie! <laughs> what? There's right. no chores. Here's the story. Oh my goodness. What? Now, oh my I don't goodness. know if it was okay, completely, I don't know if this was completed due to this reason, but he said that some housemates haven't been doing their chores properly. Um, he's probably just talking about me. Um, but he said that the, the chores aren't gonna happen anymore in that way, in that roster system. So yeah, we've got to do it all ourselves now. So I think- um, We had a plan. What's that? We were yeah. going to we were, we're gonna get upset, go, I don't want to do that. We don't want to do that. What type of person are you? It would have crushed me. Oh, is that it? Yeah, I think that's it. But I might be going tomorrow night. Oh, <laughs> OK. He just laughed at me. No, it's like you do little, little cute things from time to time. Yeah, somehow. It make me go. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Ah, sitting on the side of Magpile Hill Waiting till dinner's ready so I can get my fill I'm gonna cook up a feed for me and my man I'm gonna wait till we finishes working on the land And he's gonna come home to me He's gonna come home to me and just for a treat, I might make some gravy to go with the meat. Mm -mm. Guaranteed double. She's so exciting. I felt this last time I was up for eviction, Camilla. Mm. Remember I was saying to you guys I wasn't nervous or I wasn't anything? I don't think you're going. Um, no, but anything can happen, Cam. I didn't think Galen was going. I mean, I'm pretty much in the same boat as him, so you can't... Look, Cam, at the end of the day, I honestly don't care. I'd be so ecstatic to stay, as anyone who's up for eviction would be, but if I was to go, it's been an awesome stint here, and I miss my family and friends so You're much. You're exactly so the same as me. I want You've to stay. You've been here. 110% I want to stay. I'm still having fun. It's an awesome indication that I'm not ready to go. Mm. But... Man, but we've been it's here been such a long three time. Three months. I know. It's it like... hasn't been three weeks. It hasn't been three days. Yeah. It's been three months, Cam. It's a long time. So at the end, yeah, end of the day, I don't care if it's a double. How exciting! If it's not, well, no. you know.
If I go, great. If I don't go, great. The reason why I approached you, Jamie... Was... Jamie has spent most of the day in the rewards room with Chris. Camilla now wants to know from Jamie if Chris has said anything about her. He, he's just being extremely hot and cold, and, like, regardless of regardless of whether, you know, you really um, like someone or don't, like, i just rather... You know what I mean? And at night it's very cuddly and he, like, hugs me yeah. all night kind of thing. And then and not to say I want to hang out with him all day or anything like that, because I'm not like that anyway, but... On that, he... He did say some stuff about that, but I don't want to say, I, you need to chat to him about it. But I need to know, because I don't like it that he's talking about this without, no, no, you, to you no, and no. not to me. Um, Do you know what I mean? Because he doesn't anything. address me. But he hasn't said anything like that, and I'm just, you But know. what does he say about that? Because I, I could have put an end to it a week ago. I think he was thinking, like, he, like, when you say hot and cold, I think that he, he really likes hanging out with you and having you as the, the sort of interest in here. But then I think he also wants to, because he's only here for two weeks, he wants to experience it by himself for a little bit as well. And then he wants to have time with you and then he wants to sort of, you know what I mean? Totally. Yeah, that's all it totally, is. Totally, totally. That's all it is. It's, Are you and sure? It, and yeah, there wasn't any sure. negative... No, 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 very sure. That's exactly what... Because that's exactly how I felt. And yeah. I've given him plenty of space. I'm glad you said that. And I could have picked that anyway. I was just kind of, like, it's good for someone to say that. You know, it's good for your friends to kind of give you insight into stuff. I don't think he'll, um, I don't think he'll talk to me, to be honest, before he goes. I think we're just going to leave it the way it is, which is kind of this awkward, I don't know what you're doing and you don't know what I'm doing, so. Next, the walls have ears. You reckon that, you reckon that your feelings for Katie are really what you think they are? Or, or, or what you're saying that you feel for Crystal is really true? To evict Max, SMS Max to 199 evict. To save Max, SMS Max to 199 to save. Or call 1902 555 and follow the prompts. Votes cost 55 cents each. Calls from mobiles higher. Voting lines close 8 p.m. Australian Eastern Standard Time this Sunday, the 23rd of July. Terms and conditions, bigbrother.3mobile.com.au. Hey, do you know what I want to ask Max, just in case one of us do go? Is who he had his eye on before coming in here. Okay. Did he tell you he had someone? Yes. Because I know Camilla... Hey. No, Camilla made a comment to him the first night he was yeah, here, he before did. you even came out, about Crystal. Because Camilla's like, oh, no, Crystal's taken with Galen. And um, C Camilla says something like, oh, is that the sort of chick you'll go for? Or, oh, are you disappointed now because it's the hot chicks? taken and you didn't know it's not the sort of girl i go for anyway someone else someone else something yeah wow max is really cool yeah because chris is in here in the rewards room that i feel that max might be getting left out so i don't know max who max max might be i don't know though no we've been hanging out with him all day oh cool <laughs> Jamie said he feels like Max might think he's a bit left out with him all day. Oh, he's yeah. trying cool. clothes with him all day. He's hilarious. I've been wearing his I clothes. I really like Max. Yeah. I, I just got a glimpse of what he was having a, a laugh with Chris, and I'm like, are we what here? are they laughing about? And I'm like, <laughs> uh, crap, Jamie, must be like wait, that. Wait, 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 hey! I don't usually go out with super hot girls or yeah. one nighters because they're not, like, no offence to the super hot girls out there, but they're not the girls that are out there so partying cool. and dancing and my type of style. A girl can look so ugly, like the most beautiful girl in the world can look so ugly if she hasn't got a good personality. Yeah, of course. Massively, yeah. definitely. I agree mm. with that one. Don't you reckon? Personality is yeah. massive for a girlfriend. If I'm actually going to get and that, don't have to be, I don't yeah. mean personality like, ah, this, that, the scream, because that can kill it sometimes. But just a sweet girl. That's a good person. You know, sweet, caring, always, you know, the little things that count. It's all about the little That's things. That's what I love about Crystal, because she's such a gorgeous girl, but she's got the personality yeah. with it that you just appreciate just her looks. Yeah, yeah, but yeah, it's yeah. You appreciate her looks and you can say you're a gorgeous girl because her personality just complements yeah. it. I noticed one thing really nice about Crystal and that I really took, like, one huge thing. Like, sometimes if it was a group, like, discussion, and I would talk and sometimes, like, people are so into their conversation, like, no-one would hear me, and Crystal would show us, oh, what was that, Max? Oh. You know, what was that? Like, and that's without fail. And those little things, that's what I see. I notice. Little things like that.
Do you want to make the concan really nice? Mm -hmm. Put a massive, and I'm talking like a massive tablespoon, like a massive bit of Vegemite in it. No, 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 no. That's Secret ingredient. Hey, that's what I put in the sauce earlier. Yes, the pasta sauce. Good. What's yeah. over there? This is Big Brother. Jamie. Chris. Dinner is served in the rewards room. Oh, you gotta go and eat. Oh, that's a See nice you, I wouldn't want to be here. What? Sure about that? Who's that? Over there. You can't taste the measurement. <laughs> you can't taste it. Alright, I'll try some. Look at this face. You're ruining my dinner. As Jamie and Chris prepare to leave for the rewards room, Chris grabs the elastic band out of Camilla's hair and tosses it on the floor. Thank you. Now that my hair's let down, I just feel that was so much better right there. Soon as about myself. That, that's it. Good. You've, you've oh, taught no. me something. You've something. taught me something, Chris, about myself, and and that is that <laughs> I hate men like you. Is, I'm hungry. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Where is it? <laughs> Shall we start turning this on? Yeah. Okay, we all have to stand up, and we have to make a song about each housemate. And we have to And I go. And we can judge. Max is the hardest guy in the house. What, what would His you hair do? is tighter than a little. Mouse. Camilla is a winger face. She's just a big fat winger face. Her washing up is a disgrace. She's just a big fat winger face. And she will tell it to your face. Make you feel out of place. She's just a big fat winger face. The dancing cooks. Ooh. Is that? Ah. Yeah. Yeah, actually. Yeah, the, dan the, the dancing chef. Do you want another one? The dancing chef. The dancing chef. This is Big Brother. He always says no. I've never heard him answer anything else mm. but no to a question. It's no or Big Brother will get back to you. What are you doing? Nothing. <laughs> oh. Oh. Look, they ate it all, both of them. <laughs> Maybe we should make up a story. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. So, you reckon that you reckon that your feelings for Katie are really what you think they are? Or, or, or what you're saying that you feel for Crystal is really true. Yeah, yeah, probably, yeah. Cri yeah. <laughs> pretty, pretty. <laughs> yeah, no, it, it, was, it was Crystal all along, I think. Like, but yeah, Claire as well. Like, just if I could have got both of them. Okay, let's go. <laughs> Obviously part of their plan. <laughs> Girls are so bad at doing stuff like that, man. Don't go anywhere. Coming up, it's a huge double eviction with Gretel Galeen.